This video is brought to you by Squarespace. From websites and online stores to marketing tools and analytics, Squarespace is the all-in-one platform to build a beautiful online presence and to run your business. Hey photographer, Jessica Whitaker here with my very special guest, Bumblebee. I am so excited to bring you along behind the scenes on a senior portrait session where I actually photograph one of my subscribers' senior portraits. I'm so excited for you to come along with us, see how I work, and get some inspiration for your next senior portrait session. Before we get into the video, I do want to say that I have my free photography Facebook group, Build a Bloom, linked down pointing with his paw down in the description box below. If you're craving a creative community full of 60,000 kind, encouraging photographers, that's a very specific craving, but I have it for you linked down below. All the gear that we use in today's session will be linked in the description box below, as well as my online photography workshop, the business behind photography, how to market and manage your dream ideal clients in your own backyard. Before we hop into the video, here's a message from our sponsor. A photo speaks a thousand words, but a polished and professional portfolio can get us those thousand dollar clients. Enter Squarespace, the all-in-one platform for websites and domains. Photographers, it's time to be done settling for slow loading websites with tedious plugins. I trust Squarespace's all-in-one platform to keep me booked and busy. Pick from one of their dozens of contemporary drag and drop layouts, host your custom domain and email with them, and even conduct successful email campaigns. Everything you need to run a successful photography business under their umbrella and at your fingertips. You can head to squarespace.com to begin your free trial and when you are ready to launch your beautiful professional website, you can go to squarespace.com slash Jessica Whitaker to get 10% off of your first purchase of a website or a domain. We're gonna begin our session over here by this cute little fence. I'm starting Kara out by leaning against this fence, which will distribute her weight onto it, making it more of a casual, relaxed pose. So she doesn't have all four limbs to worry about. How do I pose? Do the robot dance? You know, it's nice and cash, nice and nice and relaxed. When it comes to senior portraits, which this is a senior portrait session, chances are your client has never had their photos professionally taken before. Maybe they've had family portrait sessions taken in the past, but it's never been just on them ready for their close up. So you really wanna make your client feel as comfortable as possible. Now, this is just one way to make them comfortable in the pose. There's a lot of other things that you can do within your own customer service experience, and I teach that all in my photography workshop. But to begin in this tutorial, we're gonna have Kara leaning against the fence. I wanna see that waistline. We wanna snatch it up. So I'm going to have you actually bring this hand out just a, yeah okay and then with this arm um we will how do i put it on the waist okay yeah okay cute um i'm going to have you kara step your foot out yep and put all your weight up onto the balls of your feet yes okay six foot five <laughs> okay cute oh my gosh she said that she was a uh, the smartest person in her school and she is right okay cute The one thing that I am so particular about is hair, and that is a detail that nobody wants to Photoshop out, at least me, like that takes so long in my opinion, um, but also I'd rather just adjust it. And your client does appreciate you making all those little adjustments because then they're able to instill even more trust into you, like, oh, she cares about me looking truly my best. I'm gonna have you kind of, instead of, now I would never say this if this was a client shoot, I wouldn't be like, this is why this looks so awkward. Don't worry, this is a tutorial, okay? <laughs> so Kara, uh, instead of having you have this like stiff hand, which a lot of people will do is like, this just feels like, you know, natural, whatever. Like when you're walking past a group of people, you don't know what to do with your hands <laughs> kind of thing. But what I'm gonna have you do is instead kind of pull this away. You can still have your arm up here, but just so we have a little bit of movement so it's not so stiff right. almost. Cute, okay. Yes, okay. perfect. And then I might even have you bring your elbow out a little bit so I still see the waistline. Amazing. <laughs> and then let's turn that wrist in. And you know what, how about you grab more onto your wrist itself? <laughs> Okay, yeah, yeah. And then let's have you, um, I'm gonna have you cross your feet like this. Okay, nice. And then big smile. Beautiful, beautiful.
So I'm gonna have you put your hand in your pocket and one thing is I don't want you to tug down on the pocket too much. This is a little bit unflattering, but like, almost just resting your hand holding your hand up instead of resting it in your pocket it creates a more flattering shape also with the clothing itself because it's not tugging on anything so and then i'm going to have you with actually let's do it with both hands because then we get the nice waistline because she's kind of turned at a slight angle so this looks really pretty okay so i'm just going to have you kara bring your your back leg even further back this step okay. Yes, beautiful. Okay. I'm gonna have you put all your weight on that back leg and then actually put it on your front leg. Mm, back leg, sorry. And then turn your shoulder to me just slightly. A little bit more towards me, sorry, opposite way. Oh. <laughs> no, it's okay, okay. Perfect, perfect, okay. These little tiny changes in pose and pivoting a little bit, posture, you really wanna find the most flattering flattering pose you can for your clients especially when it's senior portraits just because this is their first time in front of the camera and you want to take the time posing them so that it instills that trust in you as a photographer with your client but also so when they look at the photos through your camera roll when you're showing them they're seeing themselves look their very best and nothing in between gorgeous I'm gonna do come on bumblebee Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I'm gonna take a little leaf, yeah. leaf in front of the um, camera, kind of add a nice little fall vibe and it will also cover up any of the other green trees around and kind of fill it in with a little bit more orange. Big smile, it's gorgeous. I'm gonna have you now, Kara, stand right here and face me straight on. I have these street lights. There's yep. some street lights that I kind of want to get in the frame for a nice bokeh, if you will. <laughs> so, okay, beautiful. Big smiles. Yes. This is great composition, if I do say so myself. We are using the road behind us as a leading line that brings the eye up to Kara. It's nice framing composition. If you want a video more detailed on composition, I do have that on my YouTube. I'll link that in an iCard, but these are so beautiful. All right, that's the tutorial. I hope that you leave feeling encouraged and inspired and that you can take some of these tips into your next portrait session. Be sure to hit subscribe down below if you wanna receive free tutorials every single week because I'm here every week for you and your business. And if you wanna take it one step further with your photography business, I will have my online photography workshop linked down below. It has blessed so many photographers and their businesses for the better. The reviews honestly speak for themselves. For more information on my online photography workshop, I'll have it linked down down below as well as a Squarespace discount code for your next website or domain. I believe in you and your business. That's why I'm here every single week creating for free for you here on YouTube. And if you can't get enough of my free tools here on a weekly basis, I also have my Instagram where I'm able to connect with you on a daily basis through Instagram stories, live stream Q and A's where I can answer your specific questions about your specific business. I believe in you and your business and I'll see you in my next tutorial. Bye.